Hey guys, um, I'll tack this onto the next episode, but uh, just a little tiny bit I wanted to record. Mounting these panels. Okay, so we're um, half an hour, hour later, and it did start to rain. As you can tell by these drops here, then it stopped. Um, I'll rest out here and move my tools and everything out of the way. And then I undid the clamps and it appears to be holding quite well. This is a good sign, it tells me that I might not have to screw these panels on. I might get away with just gluing them on. But we'll see how we go. Stay tuned for more. Really impressed with the other side, how, it's, how strong it is. It's really strong. That's, you know, it feels so solid. Look, I can rock the whole, rock the whole vehicle just by pushing my foot down on that panel. Hey guys. A um, bit more done now. I've got to make this update quick because some um, nasty looking clouds are above and it's rumbling. That's about the storm. It's roll it's these clouds are coming real quick too. Um anyway all these panels that you can see that are dark grey have all had three coats. They got two coats of this brush on light light grey primer and then they got hit with a they got, they got sanded again and then they got hit with a, a coat of the darker grey they need a second coat of the darker grey but they need a sand between and they also need some repair work so you can see here because it's ply we've got little bits that need a bit of putty putty in a sand don't know if you can hear that thunder crackling guys so I've got to be quick um, so these two side panels aren't, and the tailgate aren't painted on the inside yet, but the nose is. Um, let me show you that. It's in the lighter. That's the light colour primer. You see the difference in the colours there. Yeah, I'll just sort of put the wheels there and put all these panels there just to give you an idea. That's obviously the template bonnet which doesn't fit <laughs> um, I've had to make the bonnet a bit longer because I've extended the nose a fraction and so here's the bonnet corners still aren't cut on it here's the other window surround um, and these two bits are the corner pieces that go beside the nose in these gaps here under the headlights uh, the wheels are just sitting there guys just to give you an idea of how it's going to look um, we've got no wheel guards yet the surrounds I've got the material cut for them all but they're not they're cut to length I mean to, to width but they're not cut to length so they need all the angles cut and to the right sizes and then they'd sand in and paint in. Um, they're going to be black. Just uh, thought I'd give you an update. Show you that progress is happening. It's kind of exciting. I'm, I'm pretty happy where things are. Um, so yeah, I'm probably looking at about another week to finish this body work off. Because I've got to do the guards. Um... Not sure if I'll get time to do the front and rear bumper in that time, but they're the, they're the only bit of manufacturing I've got to do on the body work. Front and rear bumper bar. And um, next video we should have wheel arches and those nose bits done. Everything painted, the windscreen and the roof done. Um, and then I can work on things like... 
the the frame and the suspension and the inner guards the floor yeah lots of stuff like that cheers guys thanks for watching please like comment subscribe um yeah next episode we'll have um like i said wheel arches roof and windscreen the nose will be finished off and probably the bumpers and all these panels will be primed up not painted but they'll get a, a second coat of this primer ready for paint um and then i'll um i know i might actually get some paint and paint it but yeah we'll just see how we go i've got a bit bit low on cash so anyway guys um like comment subscribe see you in the next video cheers